Hello everyone, and welcome to my Sister Wise For You channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Speaking candidly, Janelle Brown discussed her first Mother's Day without her son Garrison Brown. I had a surprisingly emotional Mother's Day. Simply put, I've never really celebrated holidays. Every day, my kids make me feel special and they have always supported me, the 55-year-old Sister Y star stated on Instagram on Monday, May 20, particularly since they grew up to be independent people who occasionally visited their parents. However, things were different this year. Along with Garrison, Janelle has her three children with her ex-husband, Cody Brown, Logan, 29, Madison, 27, Hunter, 27, Gabrielle, 22, and Savannah, 19. The main sorrow that befell the Brown family earlier this year was Garrison's suicide at the age of 25. I felt the pain so close to the surface the entire weekend, and when I baked this easy pie, it was very meaningful. Janelle went on. This pie seemed meant to be, especially after our strawberry picking adventure and the chance discovery of rhubarb at the neighborhood farmer's market. Janelle revealed that she chose to spend the day preparing her family's favorite dish, strawberry rhubarb. Maybe Garrison enjoyed it the most out of all of them, and it made this pie a bit bittersweet, she wrote, attaching a photo of the delicious dessert. Every day I miss and love you, honey. Janelle and Cody revealed Garrison's passing in March. Cody, 55, posted on Instagram at the time, saying, Janelle and I are deeply saddened to announce the loss of our beautiful boy Robert Garrison Brown. He was such a positive influence on everyone he came into contact with. Our loss will leave a void in our life that is so immense it will leave us speechless. Please respect our privacy and join us in paying tribute to his memory. Us Weekly verified that on March 5, law enforcement officials showed up at Garrison's Flagstaff, Arizona, residence. He appeared to have self-inflicted a gunshot wound when the police found him dead at the scene. Garrison's autopsy report, made public in May, stated that he died from a gunshot wound to the head and was declared to have been a suicide. Garrison's cousin Emma Brown said that a funeral was performed in his honor a few days after he passed away. Janelle honored Garrison on his would-be 26th birthday on Instagram, one month after his demise. Happy birthday, my love. You are sorely missed today. It's difficult to comprehend that you're no longer among us. Janelle posted on Instagram in April. We had a great conversation about you today, and even had dinner at Texas Roadhouse, your favorite restaurant. I can still sense you around occasionally, and I'm thankful that after my adventure is over, we can see each other again. At the time of his death, Garrison Brown, a former cast member of Sister Wives, had three times the legal blood alcohol limit. Brown's blood ethanol content was 307%, according to the official autopsy report that Us Weekly was able to get on Wednesday, May 15. For adults over 21, 0.08% is the legal limit. Although Brown had a toxicology report completed, a gunshot wound to the head was the cause of death. One theory for his death was suicide. Cody and Janelle Brown, Garrison's parents, revealed in March that their son had passed away at the age of 25. Garrison Maddie and the brothers Logan, 29, Hunter, 26, Gabriel, 21, and Savannah, 18, were among Janelle and Cody's six children. Cody, 55, posted on Instagram at the time, saying, Janelle and I are deeply saddened to announce the loss of our beautiful boy Robert Garrison Brown. He was such a positive influence on everyone he came into contact with. Our loss will leave a void in our life that is so immense it will leave us speechless. Please respect our privacy and join us in paying tribute to his memory. It was verified by us that upon the arrival of authorities at Garrison's Flagstaff, Arizona residence, they found him deceased, seemingly from a self-inflicted gunshot wound. Additionally, according to the investigators, 
Garrison's brother Gabriel discovered his body. According to a police record that us was able to get at the time, Janelle, 54, informed law authorities that Garrison had written a concerning message to a group chat that contained those who deal with the Brown family. Following the news of his passing, I want to be angry with you for sharing the fun moments. However, I am unable to. These days, I miss them, Garrison allegedly wrote. Janelle discovered the post even though she wasn't in the group chat and contacted her son to see how he was doing. After a short exchange between mother and son, he stopped answering. Not long after Garrison died, there was a funeral. His cousin Emma Brown paid tribute to her late relative on social media. Greetings, Robert, this is all I wish you could have heard before I had to say goodbye, but I had to get ready for your funeral today. Emma said, we love you, in a heartfelt Instagram post in March. I'm not even in possession of a photo of you without your infectious smile. I'm not sure how to express how much I'll miss you. I wish I could hug you and tell you how much I appreciate you. Even though you were only human and had imperfections, our friendship never wavered in my mind. The coroner has determined Garrison Brown's official cause of death. Us Weekly can confirm. A gunshot wound to the head caused Brown's death, an autopsy report stated. It was determined that he killed himself. Stars of Sister Wise Cody and Janelle Brown revealed on March 5 that their son Garrison, 25, had passed away. Us Weekly verified that when authorities reached Garrison's Flagstaff, Arizona, residents, they found him lifeless and suffering from what seemed to be a self-inflicted gunshot wound. The source was also informed by the police that Gabriel Brown, Garrison's brother, discovered his body. Cody, 55, posted on Instagram at the time, saying, Janelle and I are deeply saddened to announce the loss of our beautiful boy Robert Garrison Brown. He was such a positive influence on everyone he came into contact with. Our loss will leave a void in our life that is so immense it will leave us speechless. Please respect our privacy and join us in paying tribute to his memory. According to a police report that us was able to get, Janelle, 54, informed authorities that Garrison had posted a message to a group chat that contained individuals who work with the Brown family one day after he passed away. I want to be angry with you for sharing the fun moments. However, I am unable to. These days, I miss them, Garrison allegedly wrote. Janelle supposedly found out about his response even though she wasn't in the chat, and the two of them conversed briefly before he stopped answering. Kenia Gutierrez, a close friend of Garrison, fought back on his shocking death after his unannounced demise. It was not what I expected. You would always want to visit him, and he would always greet you. She told us on March 7 that everything was normal in the days preceding Garrison's passing, adding that his presence was being gracious. He was content no matter what. It was startling what transpired. A few days later, Emma Brown, Garrison's cousin, revealed that the family had buried Garrison. Greetings, Robert, this is all I wish you could have heard before I had to say goodbye, but I had to get ready for your funeral today. Emma at the time posted a lengthy message on Instagram that said, We love you. Maddie Brown, Garrison's sister, disclosed that mental health had a role in her brother's demise over a week after his funeral. Having good mental health is crucial, and I feel like we don't talk about it enough. 28-year-old Maddie wrote on Instagram on March 18, I believe we could be doing more to raise awareness. It wasn't lovelessness or bullying on Garrison's part. It had to do with mental wellness. I don't think it gets talked about enough in a way that makes sense to people, so I'm going to keep talking about mental health and self-care until I'm blue in the face. In addition, Maddie explained that social media is not real and urged her audience to be more authentic online. A highlight reel is shown here. Because he was comparing himself to things on social media, Garrison used to feel like he wasn't doing enough. I don't think that's real, and I think we need to remember that, she continued. Garrison, Maddie, Logan, 29, Hunter, 26, Gabrielle, 21, and Savannah, 
18, were among the six children of Janelle and Cody. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any updates.